Good evening everyone, I'm Kim, welcome to my channel. I love all things Lux and if you are new here, I love talking about handbags and luxury. So if you are a returning viewer, thank you so much. It means so much to me that you've hit that subscribe button. And um, today's video is one that has been inspired by another YouTuber, one that I love to watch. I've been watching Dale. For a few years now, Dale lives in Australia and she is coming to Europe this fall and uh, she has purchased a Mulberry handbag for that trip. I will link her video below um, of her review of that bag. It's a beautiful bag. I won't spoil it, but it did get me inspired to make a review of my own um, Mulberry handbag. So I have three Mulberry handbags, but this one is definitely my favourite. It's the Lily model. I purchased it about 10 years ago and it is in the Oak Deer. And it's the size large, I think. And it's just such beautiful grained leather. It's so beautiful. And then it's suede on the inside on the flap. I'll open it up for you. I have it stuffed at the minute because it's just so soft and floppy otherwise. So it has one behind pouch, just one, and one set pouch. Sorry, one set pouch, and it, it fits a phone. And it also, I think it fits my mini pochette as well, my Louis Vuitton. And it also has one telephone holder. Usually I put my car keys in there though. I just find it a bit fiddly. It has the gold turn lock and the chain strap. It's a great size of bag. I will stand up. I can wear it cross body and it just hits me below the breast and above the hip. Um, I'm just to give you a sense of that. Uh, it is also a shoulder bag. So if I stand back, that is where it hits me on my shoulder. I love this bag. It's a really dressy bag for me and it's not um, loud luxury. It's very subtle and unless you are a handbag lover or a Mulberry fan, you would know that it was Mulberry with the subtle Mulberry sign. It is a classic model. They've been making the lily for, oh, I'm gonna stretch out here, probably for 15 years now. Um, I love the Mulberry lily when I've seen it. Mine is the older model. As I say, I've had this bag for about 10 years now. My strap is attached to the sides, the newer model, it's attached to the, the flap. So yeah, it's a great bag. It um, was purchased from Mulberry Direct, but I bought it in a sale, so I got a really good discounted price. And um, Mulberry do do sales, and that's one thing that I like about Mulberry, that they do do sales. However, I will never probably purchase a uh, Mulberry again at full price because not with this bag, but with another bag that I purchased in 2012. I bought it maybe three or four weeks before the Christmas sales, thinking luxury wouldn't be heavily reduced. And in the Harrods Christmas sale, it was sold with 50% off. I had purchased that bag from Harrods, so um, I will never buy a Mulberry again at full price um, unless it's a model that I know will be reduced. But yeah, and so keep an eye out for the Mulberry sales, they do do great sales. They do sales through their website direct and they do the summer sale and they do a Christmas sale. Also Mulberry is widely available from House of Fraser, Harrods, Barn Thomas, all those big department stores. So it is really good that you can actually pick up special offers, maybe 10 or 20% off throughout the seasons. 
when they're running their specials as well as the summer sales and Christmas. So this is my um, Mulberry Lily. I love it. It's a great bag. It fits a lot of stuff in. It packs a punch for the money. Um, it definitely is nowhere near the price of Chanel and other luxury houses. It is a British company, Mulberry. However, a lot of their stuff is sourced out to China to be made. I actually am not too sure if there is a made in bag. I will look to see. Um, this bag was actually made in Turkey. So um, it's not the high end French fashion houses, but it is a British brand. You are getting good quality, although it was made in Turkey. Um, I'm very pleased with the product that I have. It's a lovely handbag and a, a bag that features in my collection and I'm glad that it's there. Um, why do I have this bag? More for formal events. It's probably a bit too big to be a day bag at a formal event. Um, and such as weddings and that. However, I have worn it. Um, being a mum of three, I have to carry a lot of stuff belonging to them. So it's a dressy bag um, for whenever I am out and about. And I, as I say, have used it for functions before in the past. It's a great everyday bag. Also, it's a lovely evening bag and it can be used for special occasions. So overall, it's an all-rounder and it's a thumbs up for me. If you have enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, like and comment and don't forget to subscribe. It costs a small thing but will mean a lot to me. Thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and please check out Dale's Addiction. She has some beautiful bags and a lovely mulberry as well. Thank you very much. Bye now.